The Wildfires on the Air. Welcome to the April edition of the Wildfire Podcast. I'm your host, Stefan. Some of you watching our podcast are wondering, what is West Place Clubhouse? West Place Clubhouse is a volunteer-based work order day program that helps members with mental illnesses get back into the workforce. With help from a marvelous and loving staff, members can work on job and education skills in a safe environment. If you would like to become a member or have any questions regarding the program, please contact Joe, Judy, or Rhonda at 724-834-2727, extension 19, the front desk. And now, on with the show. We now bring you our first segment, something I like to call It Came From The Kitchen, featuring member Jerry. Hello, Jerry. How are you doing today? Fine, Stefan. How are you? Good. So, what's on the uh, menu for the month of April? Okay. April 3rd, Monday. Rigatoni with meatballs and garlic bread. Tuesday the 4th, stuffed banana peppers with a side of spaghetti. Wednesday the 5th is our Easter dinner, ham and lamb. Thursday the 6th, Big Mac tater tot casserole. Friday the 7th, fish sticks with mac and cheese. Monday the 10th, stumbolis and a salad. Tuesday the 11th, pot roast with potatoes, carrots, and onion. Wednesday the 12th, gnocchi with baby spinach and bacon. 13th, Thursday, steak and cheese with waffle fries. Friday the 14th, barbecue rib with baked potatoes and a vegetable. Monday the 17th, spaghetti with a salad. Tuesday the 18th, breakfast for lunch. Wednesday the 29th, or the 19th, kielbasa and halushki. Thursday the 20th, deep fried fish and macaroni salad. The 21st, Friday, steak and mushrooms and a baked potato. Monday the 24th, cheeseburger with french fries and peaches. Tuesday the 25th, tuna melt with potato salad. Wednesday the 26th, chicken noodle casserole. Thursday the 27th, broccoli, cheese, and bacon soup with a salad. Friday the 28th, baked pork chop with mashed potatoes and a vegetable. And Saturday is our social, and the menu is grilled cheese with tomato soup. Wow, that all sounds great, Jerry. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Next up, we have news from our snack bar. Presented in a segment called Snacks and Stuff, brought to you by Snack Queen Danielle. Hi! So, what's going on in the snack bar? The pop is 50 cents, chips is 55 cents, combos are 75 cents, candy is a dollar. You can learn your customer service, stocking, register, and math skills there. Wow. So, there's a lot of goodies in the snack bar. Good candies, soda, yes. and all that. Okay. Well, thank you for the update. You're welcome. Up next, we bring you the director's desk. This is a segment where we give you updates concerning job openings in the county and information about our spectacular transitional employment program, TE for short. Today, we have Danielle here as a member, and she's going to explain to us what a... Uh, Transition Employment Program and what, what it's about. So tell us, Danielle. The tr Transitional Employment is six to nine months, part-time, and does not affect your benefits. West Place Clubhouse provides transportation to and from the job site. First, the job coach learns the skills and teaches the member the skills. The job coach will stay with the member until the member feels comfortable with the job. We also have Wallace Fitness Custodian coming up in May, an opening for them. So anyone that's uh, listening that's a member and if you're interested in being part of the program, um, you can talk to our director, Rhonda, or you can talk to um, staff members, Joe and Judy. Thank you, Danielle. You're welcome. 
And now we present you with a special interview of a Clubhouse member who will share a bit about their experience at West Place Clubhouse. Today we have Danielle, a member here at West Place Clubhouse. How are you today, Danielle? I'm good. So tell me, how long have you been a member of Clubhouse? Ten years. What are some of the activities you do here at Clubhouse? I go to sheets, gospel presentations, food bank, cook, snack bar, news at noon, afternoon newscast. Oh, that's a lot of different activities. That's great. So uh, tell me, how has Clubhouse helped you in your daily life? It helped me with my depression and anger. Okay. Have you ever participated in the Transitional Employment Program? No, I have not. Okay. What do you like the most about Clubhouse? Editing the newscast. That's a lot of fun, huh? Yes. Okay, and uh, I'd like to take this moment to thank you for allowing us to interview you for this podcast, and thank you very much. You're welcome. And now we present you with a special interview of a Clubhouse member who will share a bit about their experience at West Place Clubhouse. Today we have Joey, and uh, we're going to talk to him about his experience here in Clubhouse and some cool stuff that he's doing, too. So how are you today, Joey? I am doing good. How about you? Doing well, thanks. So how long have you been a member of Clubhouse? For six years. Okay. What are some of the activities you do here at Clubhouse? The newscasts and clocks. How would you say Clubhouse has helped you in your daily life? Organizing and then the West Place Clubhouse has provided opportunities for me to develop and utilize my artistic abilities and grow creative, which has been a stepping stone in my becoming more self-confident and more comfortable working with others. Okay. So I understand that you uh, like animation and, and you're working on an animation project for Clubhouse. Can you that tell me a little correct. bit about that? So what I do is I bring my own laptop and um, create um, animations and then I put that laptop to a USB drive to connect it to the laptop and then I send it over to West Place Clubhouse where they take the USB drive and plug it into the computer that they have and then use it with the newscast. Okay. And I understand that your latest animation is about uh, Easter. Yes. We have an Easter bunny with one little, um, one little um, air with going up and down on the eye. Oh, that's cool. Um, here at West Place Clubhouse, members have a goal plan, and the goal plan consists of different steps that they can take to completing any type of goal that they want to fulfill in their life. And uh, Joey, um, talk, can you talk to me a little bit about what those domains are that members can work on? Yes, and like you said, each member has their own individual plan, for, so for um, social Talking to members, becoming comfortable engaging with another, developing positive, appropriate social skills to build healthy relationships to increase their wellness. And then we got the living domain, which is develop daily living skills, cleaning, cooking, hygiene to live more independently, working, which is develop marketable skills for employee, and um, also the learning goal, which is develop skills to obtain a GED or college degree, typing, spelling, reading, and math. Okay, so each member can choose pick to one of pick them. one of them or... Or chose, and depending on what that goal is, it helps them out here, which will give them eventually a good job. Okay. Well, thank you very much, Joey, for talking about this with us. You're welcome. All we have for you this month, be sure to catch the next episode of the Wildfire Podcast. This is the Wildfire signing off.